Can duct tape save your life? Let's talk about that. Good Mythical Morning. On yesterday's show, we learned that you can make an incredible robber mask out of duct tape, but that's not the only thing you can do. Lizzie is currently holding her entire car together with duct tape based on the looks of her front bumper. <laughs> <laughs> I saw that. And uh, I'm pretty sure you can treat a broken leg with it. I've seen that in one or two documentaries. I haven't done it personally and I don't plan on doing it. We're gonna break a leg today. But we have pulled together a bevy of things that purportedly you can do with duct tape. So let's get weird with it, duct tape. All right, say you wanna snack on some pickled thing in a jar and jars typically should be open with hands but as we all know, sometimes those jars don't cooperate unless you have duct tape. I've been struggling with this particular jar of pig's feet oh. forever. The thing just, it, it doesn't, doesn't wanna come off. See, I want this to come off so badly because all I wanna do is eat the pig's yeah, feet. Yeah, suck on those pig's um, feet. And I have learned a technique of using the duct tape I'll get ahead of the game. And then you one. do the same thing because you, you have a jar you're going to open too. Um, you're going to take a strip like that and then you're going to layer it triple deep. Triple, triple deep. deep it. Because what you're going to ultimately do is you're going to wrap this duct tape around the top of the pesky jar, the stinker jar, and you're going to open that stinker up. So I've got a triple threat of duct tape here. And the key is you want to start with the stickiness on the underside of the lid because that gives you a little more grip and then pull her up on the side, and then stick her down on top. Why is it a she? Because she's not cooperating, and that's what they do. <laughs> okay. Uh, so then, I got me a handle here, and I'm just gonna- Good luck. I'm gonna give it a little pickled pig's feet pull. Oh, oh crap! Dang it! All right, we got it. It just went all over my <laughs> laptop, yeah, that's man. Right, that's your laptop. Dang it! I was gonna say you might want to go easy on it. I tried to go easy on it. Now you try. Now I'm a little nervous that this snake fish is gonna pop out and oh my gosh. go somewhere and land on my laptop. Oh gosh! Oh, I'm nervous. <laughs> man, it really. Oh, am I getting? Make sure it's on there. Just pull it. I'm getting sweaty. <laughs> Man, it's like it's glued on there. <laughs> hey, Matt, I had to get you back for making me put the pig's feet on my laptop. This I is glued on there? I super glued it. Well, I got Chase to super glue it. I can see it now. <laughs> I bet you I can get it off. Here's the trick. It's not gonna. Nope. Go, it's not. <laughs> you're gonna rip. You're gonna rip the tape before. All right. Goes I super glued that one, Ugh. but I didn't know I was gonna have a but, catastrophe. But you know what? Hand. We proved it works. Well, I mean, if it's not super glue, glue it. yeah, it, but yeah. it works. Let's do another one. Okay, sometimes you just want to remove hair, and you don't have uh, the typical utensils. But you have duct tape. Um, so, Link, do you have any place on your body that you would like to get rid of hair? Um. Well. Right here, because if I was gonna wear a right watch, here, more roof. I don't like it to be hairy under where I wear a watch or one well, of those athletic bands. Yeah, because they grab the hair. Right. Put it right there where my watch would go. Yeah, right here, right? Just you're gonna, right. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You're gonna yank my vein out. Just right there. Ooh. Okay. Nope. Now let's not build this up. Just do it. <laughs> no, but I don't know how you're gonna ring it around. Right. Well, let me show you. I might punch you in the face. <laughs> I'm gonna come all the way around, okay? <laughs> <Don't>. <laughs> Three, two, Ah! Oh, that wasn't that bad. No hair came up. Uh, actually, a fair amount came up, but not enough for a watch. Nope. What, what hair do you want removed? Well, I've been, my napes are kind of out of control at this point. <laughs> and I usually, I cut my own napes, but uh, I saved them for this special moment. Turn, turn around even further. There you go. Gotta get a nice line with it. You could be a barber if this goes well. Duct tape barber. You ready? Mythical Beast in Des Moines, Iowa. This is for you. Three, two, one. Oh! Uh, that one, nothing. Well, it like, it grabbed and pulled it. Didn't, you didn't pull it straight off. The pain came from the yank of it. Do we have any more of that super glue? 
I don't think that I don't think duct tape is a good hair remover. It didn't even he didn't even scream that loud. Let's move on to something else. Okay, this one could potentially save your life, at least according to some people. Yeah, you might see before some hurricanes, people will tape an X on a window. The idea is that if the window breaks, it'll stay together, which will protect you from getting hit with glass, and it also makes cleanup easier. Right. We're gonna test it out. Uh, we've got one control window, no tape, and then we're gonna put our duct tape X onto this one. All right, so just all the way across here. And then I'll do one up okay. front. Now make it, make it stick now. Make it stick. You know, and just, you know what? Let's give for the, equal, yeah. let's give the duct tape the added benefit added of the doubt. And right there. I mean, I'm actually a little bit on the frame too. I mean. Maybe that's a good thing? Oh yeah, that's a good thing. All right, let's- I don't know. <laughs> let's break this glass. <laughs> All right, I am going to smash the control window because it's closer to me. Act like you're in a riot. Woo! Yeah, angry. Break something. All right, here we go. You ready? Yeah. Hope I hit it. Yeah! <laughs> Eat it! Look at that, Link. Glass! Now go inside and steal the TV. <laughs> no, you just tag out. Now you're gonna go for that one. Here we go. Aim for the duct tape. Oh! Hey! Hey! Big time! Okay. Wow, we'd be good rioters, man. We yeah. Blew those windows out. Okay, uh, first the control group. You can see that there is glass that's still intact and it's not shattered at all. And then there's sizable shards down here. But if we look at the It's completely shattered. Tape, I mean, it's all very shattered. Even over here, and it's in a similar, we hit similar patterns, but all of this is shattered but intact. And but if you look you can down see, here. It stayed together, and this piece of duct tape did a little of the cleanup for us already. Look at that. I mean, okay. would you rather have this situation or that? I think I'd rather have this situation. So I feel like the duct tape wasn't a complete win, but it wasn't a complete fail either. Yeah, there's potential in this. Partial and, win for the duct tape. And it looks great on your windows. Yeah, it does. Now hammocks are a thing of luxury, but they're also very expensive unless they're made of duct tape. That's right. Uh, this is, as you can see, a duct tape made, com uh, well, it's actually a hammock made completely out of duct tape. It doesn't feel sturdy. N neither does a regular hammock though. Uh, and we want to give a shout out to the Lazy Toaster YouTube channel. They actually made a video on how to make this. That but they did reference. not test it. That's what we're gonna do. And there's gotta be some stakes involved uh, for a proper test. If this thing fails, you're gonna land in a raft of chocolate syrup. All right, get on there, Rhett. All right, hopefully that will happen. About to take a again. chocolate bath. Okay. Ooh, distribute your weight as quickly as you can. Lean back, lean back, lean back, lean back. You look comfortable. Yeah, I'm so comfortable. <laughs> oh, look at that. How does it feel? Feels really nice. <laughs> I'm gonna comment on something. It feels better than rope. The duct does tape, it? the flatness of it feels so nice. And I feel so confident in this structure. I bet you I can drink some of this chocolate syrup without falling into the thing. All right, do it. Oh, let me see if I can, I have to get down. I have to get, I'm um, oh, oh, almost get. <laughs> Oops, sorry. Whoops. It. I was having an experience. Like <laughs> Why you gotta do that? I was so stable. I was about to get a little kiss of chocolate. And now I've gotten, I'm, I've gotten intimate with the chocolate, <laughs> un unintentionally. I think this really passes the test. All right, another thing you can do with duct tape, apparently, is make a pillow suit. I'm yeah. gesturing at you because it's gonna be you. Now, you uh -huh. may have seen this on Community. It supposedly makes you invincible. Are I'm you game. ready to be invincible? Yes, Okay, finally. I'm gonna need to get some help uh, to make this happen. We're basically gonna tape a bunch of pillows to you. <laughs> Using duct what? Duct tape. So let's go to the front. Raise your arms up. Ooh. 
Okay, I think that's pretty much it. Uh, but I do have one finishing touch. Can I have your glasses? Yeah. Well, I can't reach them. My mouth's right there. Yeah. Oh, hello! I am Pillow Man! <laughs> wow, there's a whole lot happening in this area. Okay, Link, in order to test just how... Uh, <laughs> Jip it up, y'all! <laughs> just how foolproof this suit is, I want to do something I call the ball test. It's not what's happening right now. Put me in a music video, y'all. Let's go. To the ball test. <laughs> okay, Link, welcome to the ball test. I am not Link, I am Pillow Man. Welcome, Pillow Man, to the ball test, uh, where I have a bunch of balls, and I will be aiming at a certain area of your body, Pillow Man. Pillow Man hot. Ready? Uh, oh! <laughs> I'm good. How's that? I'm good. I'm good. Oh, I'm good. Oh. <laughs> I barely felt that, homie. I'm gonna hit you in the front. You ready? Oh! <laughs> oh! You missed the pillow! You missed the pillow! How about a softball? Oh! Oh, yeah. Okay. I need a, some slingshot assistance. Harder! I'm impervious to your piddly little balls. Right. When the ball test fails, you move on to the bat test. What? Oh! Oh! Yeah, 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 yeah. You don't feel that? Nothing! Nothing! Bring it, bring it! Bring it all you don't day, feel all that? No, yeah, you tell yeah, me you yeah, don't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what? Yeah, you don't. Come on, yeah. You don't. You don't. Yeah. Well, Woo. this is definitely the best thing we've done with duct tape all day. Yeah. Thanks yeah. for liking, yeah. commenting, yeah. and subscribing. You know what time it is. Yeah. <laughs> it's time to spin the wheel of Mickey Cowley. You know what you don't need duct tape for? The Good Mythical Morning Poster! Uh, Available at redlink.com slash store. Of course, if you rip uh, it, that was kind of a weak spin, Pillow Man. I can't help it. Are you having some limited range of motion? A little bit, yeah. <laughs> okay. Rhett and Link assess their microphone like a piece of contemporary art. Oh! If you'll direct your attention to right in front of us, I would like to uh, draw you to your attention this amazing piece of art. Oh, you work here at the yes. museum? Yes, I work here, and I, I'm also a piece. Oh! Yes, I I'm thought it was maybe like so you wouldn't bump in into any of the art well, and hurt it, or hurt I, yourself. I, I was just a um, a tour guide. Well, I appreciate you. And I, I was pro- I oh, appreciate you. Was that a tip? And I, then... I was prone to accidents, so they just a pat. they turned me into an installation. Thank you, thank w you. What are you called? Thank you. I'm called Irma. I, I felt nothing. I was really giving it to you. Whew. Okay. That was fun. Yes. That's fun, man. Just there's nothing like the feeling yeah. of knowing that your balls are impervious. <laughs>